Welcome to our daily devotion. It's Thursday, June 11th, and this is day 86 of our temporary pause of on-campus activities in response to the coronavirus pandemic. I'd like to read for you the words of Psalm 90, verse 12. So teach us to number our days that we may present to you a heart of wisdom. Teach us to number our days that we may present to you a heart of wisdom. Now, every single daily devotion, as you know, I number. And you may wonder why. Well, I've done that because the devotions are given within the context of us pausing our activities in response to the coronavirus pandemic, an unprecedented thing to do in our lifetimes. So each devotion is tailored to that. That's that secret behind the numbering. But you also number your days as well. Let me see if you counted down these periods of time. 15 days to slow the virus, 45 days to stay home, stay healthy, stay connected. And how about those eight days of a curfew from 8 p.m. to 4 a.m.? Now, God tells us to number our days, but it's not to watch us get older or to mark time. He tells us to number our days for a very different reason, because he wants us to realize that our days on earth are short lived. And he wants us to make the most of gaining knowledge and wisdom about him. Now, how do you go about doing that? Gaining a heart of wisdom. Well, I thought that could best be illustrated by giving you three questions to ask. And I actually wrote these down and put these on my desk by my computer monitor because there are three reminders on how we can grow and have a heart of wisdom and use our days wisely. First question, what did I read in the Bible today? Now, if you follow along in the Bible for these daily devotions, way to go. But if you just merely listen to them, I want you to get into God's word, to read it yourself. So what did you read today is the first question. What did you ask God to change in you? In other words, based on what you read, what are you asking God to make a change in you based on what you read? So for me, it would be to make the most of each day, to grow in my knowledge of God and to grow in wisdom. And the third question is this, have I enriched someone else's life? So have I taken what I've learned in the Bible, asking God to make the change in me, and have I applied it in the world around me? That's simply loving God with all our heart, soul, mind, and strength, and loving our neighbor as ourselves. So how can we number our days so that God can teach us a heart of wisdom? I'll read those three questions again. What did I read in the Bible? Two, what did I ask God to change in me? And three, how did I enrich someone else's life? Let's pray. Almighty God, we ask that as each day passes, we would not near merely wait for it to be over and wait for this virus pandemic to be over, but rather to use it to gain a heart of wisdom and knowledge about you. Get us back in reading your Bible, actually reading it ourselves, to ask you to make changes in our lives based on what we've read and to apply it to the world around us by enriching someone else's life each day. We ask for these things in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. And now may the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord look upon you with favor and give you his peace. Amen.